If you guys are having uh, hand issues, elbow issues, spinning gears, some, for some reason it's hard on your back and your wrists and your hands. A lot of guys tend to hold kind of like nervous, or I used to do it, just hold too tight. I found over the years, if you can let the rod, bait caster or spain float in your hand, don't hold it tight. I'm the same way with a bait caster. When I hold a bait caster, it's loose. I mean, if you, it's not loose enough to where a fish can jerk it out of my hand, but it's, it's, I'm, not, I'm not gripping it. I just like to let it float. And when I hold a spinning rod, I, I change up. I hold, I hold in front of the reel a lot just because of leverage. Um, I put a finger on the blank up here for leverage. It's not for feeling the bite. It's actually for, for pushing down on the rod to pulling up, pushing down. And it seems to really work for me. I don't know. I haven't really noticed. I haven't really paid attention to how other people hold their rods. I just know this works really well for me. It's very comfortable. Um, got a ton of torque. I mean, I mean, as far as like setting a hook on a fish, it, I, I have to be careful. Even with sunline, which is incredible stuff, not to break them off. Um, but again, I'm snagged right now, which is all right. Cause I mean, I can use that to show you guys. So you're letting it flow. Um, throughout the day, I'll change my hold. I might I'll hold it like a bait caster, hold it upside down, sideways. It doesn't matter. I'll hold it back here sometimes, but just try to try to hold it loose. Try not to grip that thing. Gripping it will end up stressing your arm, stressing your back. It'll actually cause pain in your neck. That's where a lot of that pain comes from, gripping too tight. So it might help you to actually loosen up and, and relax and just kind of, when you get bite, when you get a bite and you're holding it like this, it's not, it's, you know, what is it, a tenth of a second to grip down and, and set the hook? And uh, the finger here is, is really, that's what it's for. I kind of, it's just that leverage to get comfortable with it. When a fish does bite, I push down hard, and I pull up hard. And when I'm at that point, this rod is like, you, I'll, I can snap the rod here. I have so much leverage. And a lot of times I'll actually put this part under my forearm. And uh, unbelievable amount of leverage you can get that way. But again, until that point, to, your, to the point of setting the hook, loosen up. Try it, it'll work for you. Hopefully it'll, it'll help you if you have any issues. Plus, um, I think uh, we'll do some stretches for you guys, maybe for the ones that are having problems. I know it's out there because I've gone through it, and a lot of my friends that fish for a living, I've gone through a lot of the same issues I have. So hopefully it'll help you guys. Good luck fishing. <laughs>